A company in Kenya hopes to tackle the country's housing crisis by thinking outside of the norm and using 3D printed homes. The housing need on the continent is huge. It's more than 2 million houses here in Kenya. It's more than 10 million in Nigeria. And we know that if we want to clear that backlog, we need to build differently. We need to build at scale with speed and with low carbon materials. And this is what construction 3D printing makes, uh, makes possible so that we clear that backlog soon. The construction company 14 Trees uses a machine that layers special mortar to create concrete walls. The process to build these 3D homes is significantly faster than that used for traditional homes. And the positive feedback we had was on the aesthetic and, and the pricing and the location of the project we delivered, uh, the, the areas for improvement that they gave us and that we are introducing on the second phase is the size and the shape of the different rooms. But this is basic feedback that you always get on the development and that we will integrate on the next project. Currently, the 3D homes are pricey for most Kenyans. They range from 22,000 for a two bedroom or 29,000 for a three bedroom, but they are working towards bringing down the costs. Yeah, in spite of the great potential of 3D printing technology, it will still take a long time for it to be able to compete with the brick and mortar. 3D printing as a technology as it is currently doesn't offer all those options. So it makes it very difficult to be the silver bullet to solve the affordable housing challenge in spite of its huge potential. Out of the over 50 million people who live in Kenya, 70% of residents in urban areas live in housing without basic infrastructure. Although 3D printed housing isn't quite where it needs to be, it has the potential to one day improve the lives of many. This is the first place I've lived where it's permanently mine. This is where I've started living my life. I've never lived my life. Now I've started living my life because I have hope. This is Inside Edition Digital.